Ah welcome, I am the Moonshin King of the Century. You do you to you for you. Today we have a request by Scott Man John. Oh no, he is Scott Granati now. And he has a request for you. Who was Scott Man John is the title for today. An interview with him. He was born in 1942, died in 1999, at the dawn of the era, the new age. So the world did, in a way, die in the year 2000. The end of the millennium, death. Rest in peace for you. So this is oh no oh no oh no. So I don't know a great deal about the Scotman John, but you. But what I hear in the comments, I don't know why I went to you. I think I was thinking of you, Granati, of what you comment under my reaction videos. I should do a playlist. I'll make a playlist for Scott Manjon and uh, put it in the comments below. And the description! But from what I have heard from his music and from what I have been told, he was always very kind. He was noble. He was tasty and funky. And he lived with zero crime. Except the order of you. He sang miraculous songs such as Scatman Land. Scotland. Utopia. Songs about ideal world of acceptance and diversity and generous offerings for tea. Do you like pink tea? I bet it will be in Scotland for you. But anyway, on with the uh, interview. I am not certain when this was by, but here we are. Ah, oh, we have to speak in English. Oh, do we? Okay. European. Okay. Yeah, man, John. Yeah. Thank, thank, thank you for coming home. You. Thank you for coming home. Welcome to my house. Glad to be here, sir. That's, we're glad to have you. Oh, Look, boy. congratulations on this. Oh. Because you sold millions of this. Oh. It's only been out since the summer, hasn't it? It's, uh, it uh, came out, I think, uh, uh, in... I like that. I said that in my videos. I like that cover. I didn't realize it was an album cover, but it looks so, uh, so sleek and cool and iconic. You could see what my old Moonjin hat on that microphone. It would look very fitting. The fedora. That will be. Yes. I am not certain what songs exactly are on that album because every reaction I've done that has been pure audio has had that picture. Maybe that's his only album he did. I would have to check it out for you. August, uh, yes. It's just gone crazy all over the world. It's gone ape in Japan, it's amazing. in Europe, in, in the US, in South America. And it's America. gone ape over here too. Can you what is Scatland then? What is it? You know, what have all the kids picked up on Scatland? Uh, Scatland? It's not like Scot well, Also, I like to say, I like his tone of voice. He seems very calm. But he, he seems a little uh, tiny sense of erratic behavior. 
But it's in a calm, contained manner. He has like a youthful thing to him. I'm not certain how old he is, but he has a youthful, somehow vibrant personality. Even though he's not super loud and uh, crazy like some people I know. I look at you, for you, I look at you, to you. But he, he has a flair about him. Something quite warming for you. I also wonder why he chose to wear this hat. Quite an old fashioned look. Maybe that's his time. But it's again an iconic uh, equipment for you. No, it isn't Scotland. It's Scotland. Almost like Scotland. Almost. As, but Scotland is a magical place. See, we all know the world, right? It's in trouble. Yeah. You know, between the ozone, the real and world, the, yeah. and the ocean, and everything, and everyone is hassling, and all. Everybody's having internal problems, and all that. Scotland is a magical place. Where we can go. Where we can all go. There's no police. Everybody loves everyone there. Everybody. Trust There's no police. No police. Oh, so this is him describing this imaginary utopia land where everything is glory, everything is sweet. No need for police. Do you That's know why? Idea. Everybody conforms to natural laws. That's a good idea. Magic. Ah, natural laws. So he is a new to society. Ah, good. Good. Nudity for sure. Nudity to me. I was thinking it reminds me of John Lennon. Imagine. He said, Imagine a world with no barriers, no color and possession. I think Scotland might be that place John Lennon was imagining. Ah, he was, that's where he died too. John Lennon, he died and he went to Scotland and he watches us from, uh, from there now and of course Scotland John, he is the king of Scotland, he, he is there too for you. I hope to meet him one day and meet this uh, wonderful exposure. Do you think? Stacious? Rehestacious. Rehestacious? Yeah. Is that a new word you've invented? Uh, yes it is. Very good new mm -hmm. word. Do you mind if we take on your idea? Because we sort of have our own little world here to almost mm -hmm. want it. We'll call it Crapland. Crapland? Yeah. Ooh. Is that all right? Sounds like fun to me. Does he mean like the poo poo? Does he mean like the poo poo? I get the feeling that he is mocking him slightly. I get the feeling, uh... You see, there's a little bit of a joke around this area. Ah, you are a joker for you. Cold trainer Charlie Parker or something like that. Have you? Yeah, I like jazz. Uh, yeah. You don't. Not really. I'm a, I know I love pop. Yeah. So you don't watch the telly a lot then? No, uh, listening to music. Once in a while I turn it on. Well, I'm going to turn it on now. You are? Yeah. Oh, good. This it's is time for some TV. Hey, you're watching Rick and Men on TV. Well, I just realized this song is playing in the background. Do that, 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 you know, I was talking to a grandma of mine and she knew this song. She did not realize he performed any other songs and that is a disappointment because I have listened to a few and they are marvelous for you. I want to ask you what groovy happening tunes are on your stereo at the moment. Yeah. What's on your stereo? On my stereo? That's cutest. Mm. <laughs> Purple Rain by Prince. Artist formerly known as Prince. Formerly known, he is now Symbol. Is he? I think so. Yeah. Somebody told me. Ah. So he is a Prince fan. But he identified him incorrectly indeed. He is uh, watching this, screaming his underwear over his head and his crying. He is now a Symbol. He identified as a Symbol before he... He, he reversed it again. 
the transition back into Prince. Give me that anyway. I don't know. I don't watch TV. We don't care. Do you know what it's called? Really? No, actually. So you just still yeah. listen to the artist Prince? Yeah, P Prince is great. Great guitar player, but he, he, he ought to play more. Yeah. He should play more. Ah, that is why he does not listen to TV. He is a new society, remember? He only accepts natural behavior. So, unless it's a trail blee or a fadori. Well, I don't hear him playing enough. Mind you, he releases an album every week, doesn't he? I okay. think he does, yeah. yeah. Not all of them. Maybe. Not all of them, uh, but uh, boy, he can sure put on a great show, I'll tell you. But apart from that, you've got all the jazz greats of you in your Oh, house. I love jazz. You I think love... there's great jazz around? Ah! They are slandering Prince. I have heard that Prince puts out a lot of music. Many, many albums. Oh, I wonder what are in his voice for to poke the pies with the finger. The juicy on the slime. Good. You are greedy! Uh, no, it's just, it's, I think so. I think so. I think there's some great artists. I think there's a, a tenor saxophone play, player by the name of Branford Marsalis. Ellis is wonderful. Yeah. He's right up on it. He's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like pop though, too. Actually, pop is jazz is it if you pay attention yeah pop is jazz getting, everything comes from jazz getting too technical now is it I'm i sorry. thought everything came from the blues you're absolutely right jazz comes from the blues but the two of them come from africa oh. i think so anyway what do i know well apparently everyone comes from africa including you so unfortunately we don't go back to our roots we just let it be. Maybe we should all migrate back to Africa, to our homeland. That would be an adventure of the century. But I think it might get a little full over there. Especially when India and China come, come along to migrate. What have any of us know? I know. Nothing. Not I mean, much. Nothing. Let's watch Isn't some more TV. Nice? I like TV. Yeah. When in doubt, just watch TV. Yeah. Welcome to Lifestyle. We would like to know how would you describe yourself in a Lonely Hearts column? Huh? How would I describe myself in a Lonely Hearts column? Yeah. Well, I'm an artist. artist. Mm -hmm. Much personal integrity. So we start with artist, much personal integrity. No. said artist. Ah, he strikes me as someone, as an artist. And he has much integrity, we see from his lyrics. You see from his scatting, you cannot scat that way unless you have some integrity. Looking for... Looking for, uh, looking for a place to plant my planertias. Mm. <laughs> I bet you are. Yeah. And, uh... Ah! He wants a boo-boo! Maybe he will hate his boo-boo like Dajin in my last commentary video he he wanted a boy but it was a girl he was extremely misogyny i am not aware of scatman having a boo boo i could be wrong but i was under the impression he did not have children ah i'm sure you will inform me scat granati it would be quite tragic for you if he died without the seed of you person i'm neurotic i love being that isn't it great to be neurotic are you neurotic a little bit Lena's neurotic. a little bit yeah ah! i'm also spontaneous too i gotta be spontaneous yeah, 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 no. and i i don't ever get paranoid ah. no, never do no. No. never get paranoid not paranoid I'm never in life i gave it up for you oh i am paranoid hey he is the opposite of me maybe i am scott the man in the uh, reverse for you i am the shadow of scatman ah uh, Lent. Lent. i'm trying not to stutter shall i say it what say what scatman is a person that stutters you know that, I thought that was your start of singing all that blah, blah, yeah, blah, 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 blah. But, but but you know that's the positive part of scatman Scatman is trying to put out something positive. You're not going to hear me stutter too much here because I'm forcing it. But when I'm at home or when I'm 
I always stutter. In fact, I'm trying to help people who stutter. Good. Yeah, it's positive stuff. So he is doing a good massage. He is throwing inspiration to you. He had difficulty with his lips and his tongue. So he wanted to take advantage and strive nonetheless. He does it for you and for me. He shows that uh, despite your, your disabilities, despite your defects, you can do you. Do you? Yeah, um, yeah, um, yeah. The whole purpose of Scat Man actually is to try to put out something positive. And good you stuff. are. And Help you please. are. I hope so. I hope so. I think you are. Am I right? Okay, good. Um, but do you know, your scat language, because yeah. you know, in the lyrics there's a lot of meaning, but in yeah. the actual scat language itself, are there words there? Um, I think the, uh, scatting is composed of phrases. This is pure talent for you. Pure spectacle. Like a, yeah. It's phrases. Yeah. And what were you saying then? Uh, I was saying, if you get there and you can't make it, there you jolly well are, aren't you? I will need uh, help with this riddle. Could this be the advice that you are seeking? If you are there, you are not there, but if you are there, you struggle to be where you are. I found stuff. Yeah, it's really heavy. It's so heavy, it sits. God. Well, listen, it's, I'd like to ask you loads more questions, but we've got no more time, because that's what happens on television. <laughs> this is fun. Ray, Thanks for coming home. Glad to be on your program, Step sir. Back, John. It's a pleasure. Ooh, it was great fun. Stop. Okay, you're going to come back later, aren't you? Yeah. Thanks for coming, Shay Ray. It was gay, in a happy sort of way. See you later. Ah, so that is the interview. It, I noticed a few things from him. His body language looked like he was bored a quarter of the time. Uh, that was an epic uh, live performance by Scatman. My first experience seeing him in a live performance. <laughs> it was quite technical, it's quite baffling to witness firsthand. The best of Scatman John, the video was recorded in the 1990s. It was edited on 15th of May 2015 and released 20th of May. Thank you, I hope you enjoyed it. It was done by Thomas Freitas. I don't know if the interview was done by Thomas or the editing was done by Thomas on YouTube. I wonder why it was edited. Did they cut out some non-PC uh, experiences, I wonder. What happened to you? I didn't notice any editing, so I do wonder how much they took out, if any. <sighs> Still not exactly a uh, specific date on this, 1990, that's an entire decade. What year was it for you? I would guess 1990... Oh, five, not me. But overall I...